Hi there friends, Misha Crossing here. Welcome to another day on Kiyoshi Farm here in Stardew Valley. It's day 14 of winter. It is Harvey the doctor's birthday. Oh, it's snowing outside and we have something in the mail. And Robin is working on our new shed. Over, not shed, uh, stable over here. Oh, it's so exciting, so many things happening. Let's see who... Oh, it's Robin. How nice. I had some extra wood lying around. I thought maybe you could use it. Take care. Well, thank you. Very much. Let's see what she has to say. Be patient. I still have a lot of work to do. Okay. Not sure how long it takes for her to build the stable. Uh, it'll probably be a few days. And still, other craft tables are still working on stuff. There are my pets, my babies. Let me give them some water. We're gonna do some daily stuff. Whoops, that didn't even go in there. We're gonna do some daily stuff on the farm. Excuse me. Before going to the community center uh, and completing a couple of bundles there. Let's check in on our greenhouse. See how our crops in here are doing. Oh, we've got some fully grown pumpkins. We're ready to harvest. Uh, sunflower as well. This is still growing. I guess this is probably going to be corn whenever it's fully grown. And then we've got some more mixed seeds up here. Still, still making their way. Making their way up in the world. It's all right. We do need to... Whoops. We do need to water our crops down here. Let me check in on, on the chickies first. The chickies and duckies. <gasps> oh, a new baby duckling hatched. Yay! Trungus? What sort of name for a duck is Trungus, my dudes? Let's see. What is another Avatar The Last Airbender name? Or not even Last Airbender. It could be Korra name that I could give this ducky. I want to name something at some point, Cora, but I don't want to name just any old duck Cora, because Cora is very important to my heart. Uh, maybe I'll name a couple of, maybe rabbits, maybe some rabbits can be like Cora and Asami, possibly. My two gorals, uh, but who, who's going to, who's, who's the ducky going to be? Maybe we'll name the ducky UA. Uh, let me make sure that's how you spell spell her name. Yue is also a very important character though and I would love for her to uh, have a more prominent role in the form. Okay, that is how you spell her name. Alright, but we're just gonna go with this ducky name. Name the ducky Yue. Oh, and here's baby Yue. Look how cute she is. Oh. Thank you everybody for giving me some eggs. Let's get some hay out to feed everybody. Alright, everybody's looking looking good. Right, right. <laughs> put the hay up here so I can actually put it out. I need to put that cobblestone away or find a place on the farm to set it down. Excuse me. Pardon me. Uh, can I go ahead and start incubating? I can't start incubating another egg. Should I get another duck or another chicken? I kind of want to get another chicken and see if we can get another one of these white chickens because we have a lot of the brown ones. But another one of a different color would be really nice. I assume it doesn't matter what quality the egg is that you incubate. I don't know if that will give you a happier chick or something. I don't know. We're going to incubate that one, though. Sounds good. All right. My babies stay warm and cozy in here away from the snow. And we'll go check on our deer cows. Uh, <laughs> before watering our winter crops and then head into the community center. There are, there's at least one bundle we're going to complete today. Possibly another, I think there's one that, okay, so I've already, I've already pet everybody? Okay, I've already pet everybody. No, not this one though. Okay, there we go. Everything's good now. <laughs> Let's see, hey up here, do, do, do. I think there are a couple bundles we can complete today. We also need to find Harvey to give him his birthday present. Let's go ahead and get a little bit of milk 
from our deer. We got some large, large deer milk. Nope. <laughs> gotta wait, gotta- no! <laughs> Stay still! There we go. And last one. Alright, we got- oh, two gold star quality milks. Let's put one of these in the cheese press. Get that. No, don't drink it, you dum dum. Okay. We'll put everything else away in the goods. Um, I think I'm gonna sell. Well, I guess I should keep one large milk. I should also keep uh, these pumpkins because I don't have a lot of pumpkins. So I'll keep those keep those there and put this path and overflow and I think everything else I'm going to sell yep everything else I'm gonna sell cool do need to water these crops before we leave the farm though can't forget boop 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 Alright, water. I really just need to cr uh, craft another sprinkler to set out here. Def I mean, I have the two in the greenhouse because I thought I was going to have more crops in there, but I ended up having more crops out here. So I need to craft more. A couple to keep out here, a couple to keep in the greenhouse. Because Mama does not like manually watering crops, so let me tell you. <laughs> okay, let's see, do we have anything to forage before we go hit the handsome town doctor up on his birthday? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Now, whatever present we're giving to Harvey, I think we checked last time and we don't have anything that Harvey loves. We just have a couple of things he likes. I'm pretty sure. Okay, Harvey is, of course, in the doctor's office. Makes sense. Well, where is he? You're not good enough, friends. Oh, he's in his bedroom right now. He's not actually out, out doctoring right now, right? Yeah, he's in here. So let's at least see what present we are going to give him. Where do I need to go? I need to go to social. I need to go down to Harvey. Where is he? There he is. So yeah, he his favorites are wine, super meal, truffle oil, coffee, and pickles. <gasps> do I have pickles? I don't know why I just accidentally accidentally exited out. Got too excited about the possibility of me having pickles. No, I didn't. Wait. Yes, I do have pickles. If it's highlighted, that means that I have it. Awesome. Awesome. So I do have pickles. I do have something Harvey loves to give him for his birthday. Uh, it's interesting that he would love pickles as a present, but, you know, we are not here to criticize <laughs> Harvey's tastes. I don't know when he's going to come out of his room, though. Let's see if he comes out at one o'clock. If the changing of the hour will make him come down. Uh, if not, we'll give it a couple minutes. If not, we'll just go ahead and head to the community center and then hit Harvey up on our way back. I'm not sure what we're doing tomorrow. Maybe we'll go to the mines tomorrow. Maybe we'll... Uh, I don't know. Maybe there'll be something else going on. I'll have, I need to check the calendar and see if anything is planned for tomorrow. Okay, Harvey is not coming down. Not just yet. Abigail, oh. Hi! Wait, knew it. Oh, hello. I want to. I know. I want to know what my achievement is. Ah, <laughs> where do I? See, where can I go to see that? I've never seen. Have I gotten an achievement before? Is that a thing? I don't know. I made these two drawings. What do you think? Um. I like the jungle island and the tiger. I like the orc with the battle axe. I don't like either of them. Well, obviously, I'm not going to tell her I don't like either of them. Um. I am a big fan of tigers, but I also am a big fan of Lord of the Rings, which is where orcs come from. Mm, dilemma. I'm gonna go- I'm gonna go with the first one. Oh yeah? I guess that makes sense. I love the new dialogue with her. It makes me so happy. 
Right, let's go to the community center, I think. Yeah, we can get there this way. Is this community center? Yeah, I always forget exactly where the community center is. Right now, which one can I complete? Definitely not the fish tank. I don't know why I even thought there. Bulletin board? Nope, not that one. Maybe so. Whoop, excuse me. Oh, I think it was, I think it was this one down here that I can complete. Yeah, the crafts room I will be able to complete. So, I need to get... Yeah, the, I am going to have to use mods to spawn one item, unfortunately. I do have maple syrup that I can put in here, I think. Um, and then I am going to have to use the item spawner to get either the purple mushroom or morel or whatever. One of those things. And then fall foraging. Uh, I can't remember if I have a common mushroom or not. I know I have a hazelnut. Let me go into my chest. If you guys don't know, I do use mods with this game. Uh, this is on PC, so I can use mods. Uh, I try not to do too much cheatsy stuff. I try to go with the flow of the game and not, uh, not unlock anything too quickly, but a couple things here and there, you know, I don't really, don't really mind. Cheats and in. Okay, so there's that hazelnut. Let me see if I have that. Oh, here are. I need to find pickles. These are just. This is pickled corn, pickled tomatoes, but that's not what Harvey likes. Harvey likes pickles. Overflow? Maybe? But no, I don't have actual pickles because I have never put. I've never put cucumbers in the preservation jar or machine, whatever that's called. Yeah, so I can't have pickles, but maybe he just likes anything that is pickled, possibly. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't I do not have the common mushroom, so I am going to have to spawn uh, use the item spawner to get a common mushroom and a purple mushroom. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, and like I was saying about my mods, I have all of the mods that I use listed in the description box below. I've got links to every single one of them. Some of them are Smappy mods, which go through. SMAPI is a modding software you can use with Stardew Valley to install some mods. Uh, and some of them are just file replacement mods found on uh, Nexus mods uh, and most mods explain how to install them. And it's not really that difficult. It takes a minute to get used to, but it is not too bad. All right, we got one purple mushroom here. <laughs> Look at these. We got 999 lucky purple shorts we could have just in case we want those. And then common mushroom. Let's get one of those. No, don't eat the hazelnut. Exotic foraging bundle. I'm gonna put the purple mushroom in there. And wait, what is Oh, I needed to get the maple syrup. Da doy. Maple syrup. Wait, is it in here? <gasps> yes, it is. Yeah, so I have one the mod that I use the most is the access chest anywhere mod. It's so so useful so that you don't have to actually go back to your farm to access your chest. It's so handy. Alright, what is a reward? Oh, we get Autumn's Bounty as a reward. A taste of the season. Holy God. Plus 220 energy, 88 health, plus 2 foraging, and plus 2 defense. And we get 5 of those. That's really awesome. That's really cool. Alright, and let's complete the fall foraging one with the hazelnut and the common mushroom. Woo! As a reward for that one, we get fall seeds, an assortment of wild fall seeds, so we can plant these in our greenhouse. Uh, that's really exciting. I'm glad we got more stuff to plant in there. And now, we have completed the crafts room. This house was empty for years. The trees moved in, and so did we. But now... It is a crafts room. Once again, we are bringing back so much life and joy to the community center. I love it. And we got our little Junimo taking our, uh, our completed bundle to the little hut there. 
And so now we've completed the pantry bundle and the crafts room bundles. And... Oh, what did- Oh, he's putting the star on the- above the mantle- or on the mantle. Now there's one that I think we can complete that I just have to pay for, possibly. The vault? Let me see. No. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So this one I have to pay for. Uh, got 25,000 gold and 10,000 gold bundle. And the reward is bus repair, which I think that takes you to the desert. Let's go ahead and do the 10,000 gold bundle, and I will try to sell some stuff and make us some monies. And maybe we can complete the vault soon. Oh, a lightning rod. Collects energy from lightning storms and turns it into battery packs. I didn't even know that was a thing. How cool. Alright, I just need to make t about 12,000 more gold in order to get that 25,000 to complete the vault. Um, so that might take us a couple of days. Might take us uh, a couple of, of harvests to get to. Hi! Look at this little guy. He gets to follow me around now. He loves me because I completed the crafts room. Hee 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 hee. <laughs> Alright, we gotta go back out into town. We gotta find Harvey before his birthday is over. Uh, tomorrow we will plant these fall seeds and place this lightning rod on the farm. See what else we can get into. But, oh hi Caroline. Today I'm just going to relax and think positively. Do you ever take a day off? I think we had that exchange before, actually. <laughs> See, is Harvey still? He is still in the clinic. Hopefully he's actually where I can access him now. Oh, it's locked! Open 9 to 3. Hot diggity dang. Okay, well we're gonna have to just camp out here and wait for him to come outside then. I need to give him a birthday present. Okay, well let's talk let's talk to these girls real quick and then we'll come back up and see if Harvey's coming out. I get so sleepy when it's cold. Oh my god, me too. Hello. Um the weather's interesting today, don't you think? Yes, Penny it is, and you're so cute. Oh my god. She's just so unsure of herself. It's precious. Yo, girl, what up? Do you ever take a whole day off? Look, girl, Caroline just asked me that. It's a refreshing break. Is everybody taking a day off today? <laughs> Is Harvey still in there? He's still in there. Come on, my dude. Let me check the calendar to see. Okay, there's nothing going on tomorrow, so nobody's birthday, but then the wizard's birthday is on the 17th. I heard somebody open a door. That's probably just somebody going into the saloon. Does Harvey go to the saloon? I can't really remember. Oh, we got a Joja Cola. Heck yeah. God, Harvey better come out. I'm gonna be so sad if I don't get to give him a birthday present. There he is! <laughs> here, here, here he be. I hate to say this, but I do make a lot more money during flu season. <laughs> I guess if people stopped getting sick, I'd be out of business, Harvey. That is true. Although people do need their annual physicals. There aren't really enough people in town to, like, make enough money off of well visits. Oh, I need to get the pickles out for him. Let's give him some pickled corn. <laughs> Hopefully he'll like it. Hopefully he likes just anything that's pickled. <gasps> you remembered my birthday. Thank you. This is great. Aw, he loved it. That makes me happy. Don't get the wrong idea. I want people to be healthy. Really? Oh, that was about his <laughs> other comment that he made. Well, Harvey, I hope you have a good birthday. Let's pop into the saloon before going back to the farm chat with a couple people. How is Pam doing? Pam seems out of it. Better leave her alone right now. Is she already drunk? Did she just get here and she's already- oh we've already talked to Leah twice, but hi Marnie. <coughs> I was about to sigh and then I started coughing. <coughs> sigh. I wasn't very productive today. Marnie, that's okay. You got those days that you're not super productive. We all have them. You just gotta push through them and have a better, more productive day the next day. I need a little warm me up to get ready for another cold night on the ocean. You're going out on the ocean tonight? Jeez. Alright, talk to Harvey. Let's talk to Sam. Try not to make a mess in the house or my mom will flip. When am I in your house? Ever. 
All right, let's head back to the farm, do our final bits of tidying for the evening. Get some beauty sleep. Hey, the grid ball game is on today. This might be my favorite day of the week. All right, Alex. Alex and I don't really relate that much. He's just too into sports for my taste, and I'm sure, I am sure he gets more in-depth and more interesting as you get to know him more. He's just never been someone that I've been motivated to get to know. Though I've had a couple of people tell me that they've chosen to marry Alex and they really like his, his story, his progression. Now we got some cheese. Got some good cheese. Let me put some more milk in there. Get some more cheese to be made. Whoops. Uh, I'm gonna sell those two cheeses. Yeah, I'm gonna get some stuff out to sell so that we can start making money for that vault. Uh, in the community center. Sell a couple eggs, because there ain't no way, ain't no way I'm going to use enough of those to make enough mayo. There are always going to be some extra <laughs> sitting in there. Uh, I'll sell some cords because we have so frickin' much of it. I'll keep eight of them, I guess. Uh... I'll sell a couple topaz. Let's see, what else can we sell? Any crops I have a ton of? Well, I do have a ton of blueberries, but I do like using those to make, make jams. What about overflow? Got anything in overflow I can, I can sell? Not really. I don't think I could sell the scarecrows. I think I tried because I knew I didn't need the basic ones anymore, but I don't think I could. Right, I think this is enough. Well, I'll sell a pale ale. Oh, look at all this mayo I have. Shoot. I'll definitely sell most of that. Okie dokie. <laughs> That's enough of that. Let me get some eggs up here just to start some new mayo being made. We'll sell a bunch of stuff. I'm excited to see how much money we're going to make. It's not going to be a ton. It's definitely not going to be the 12000 that we need, but I'll go ahead and sell that Joja Cola too. Oh, actually, I should have held on to that Joja Cola because somebody asked for one in a quest one time and I did not have it. Let's go to sleep for the night. Come at the day fresh and ready tomorrow. Oh, look, and this is our reward for finishing the crafts room. We get this bridge repaired. Yeah, so we'll definitely go check this out tomorrow, too. So we're going to plant those fall seeds in the greenhouse. Um, okay, we made 6,500. Pretty good haul, if I do say myself. So definitely going to plant these crops, plant these seeds in the greenhouse, and then go check out our newly repaired bridge that is up by the Adventurer's Guild, I believe, up past the mines. Oh, and look, our winter crops are starting to grow. <gasps> we have a horse. You guys, we have a horse. Start sending me your horse mod recommendations now. Somebody suggested, uh, oh my god. Grover, aw, that's my friend's cat's name, is Grover, and he's a sweetie pie. Actually, he's a little rascal, but he's also a sweetie pie. Um, I think I am going to name the horse Appa because that is just perfect uh, for my avatar-themed farm. Is that Okay, I gotta make sure again that that is how you spell Appa. I don't want that egg on my face. Avatar. Appa. Uh, yes, that is how you spell him. Yeah. If there's a mod that turns your horse into Appa, I will literally die. I'm going to look for that, actually, after I record this episode. Oh my god, I didn't know it would be ready. So, so quickly. Oh, it looks so nice. I love the way it looks in the winter. I can't wait to see what it looks like. Uh, once the grass has grown back again. And I'm so excited to ride my horse too. Yeah, we can ride, guys, we can ride our horse to the Adventurer's Guild to see the uh, newly repaired bridge. Oh my god, and we'll get there so lickety, lickety, splickety, lickety fast. Why do only some, why does only some of the hay get eaten, not all of it? 
Do the ducklings, do the babies not, not eat it? I don't know. Just gotta make room for the hay up here. Whoops! Sorry, wrong button. Alright, let's go check on... Let's see, we'll check on our... Actually, let's go plant the seeds in the community, community center, in the greenhouse first. And then we will... Oh yeah, we do have corn! Yay, so that corn stalk will leave there, we can keep harvesting that. Uh, I do need to till the ground to plant 30, 30 of these fall seeds. So I'm just going to fast forward through all of this so you do not have to suffer through it all. Okay, my dudes, we are done in here. I'm so mad I ran out of water right before the last two seats. <laughs> That's okay, we got them all. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I just made the fertilizer and then forgot... <laughs> forgot to fertilize the freaking... Oh my god, I am the worst. I tell you what. I'm just the worst. <laughs> Oh well, we'll fertilize the next crops <laughs> before we plant those. I don't really know where we're going to place the lightning rod. I guess just right here. Sure, why not? We'll see what happens there. We got a new pale ale. Now let's water these winter crops. And then we will take our horse and check out the newly repaired bridge. It looked like- I just got a little glimpse of what was beyond the bridge. It looked like there was, uh, some stuff to forage. I- I don't- I couldn't tell if there were, like, ore deposits to mine or just regular rocks and wood. We will, uh, we'll have to investigate and see. I'm excited to see it. Let me get some stuff out of my inventory, though, and sell it. Don't need all those. All right, Appa. Let's, can we, can we, oh, there we are. Oh, oh, we're riding our horse. Oh, we're going so fast. Oh, it's so exciting. This is the first time I've ever had a horse in Stardew Valley. It's a very big day. <laughs> very big day indeed. Oh my goodness, he's riding so fast. And can we just hop off and, yeah, we can hop off and do some things and come back to him. Got a new book for the library. Let's go see what's up here. Um, I wonder if you like leave him on part of the map, if you leave your horse on part of the map and wander off that section of the map. I wonder if he stays there or if he automatically goes back to your farm every night. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. I'm so happy. We just need 5,000 more gold uh, to get that 25,000 gold and uh, I went the roundabout way to <laughs> get to the mines, but that's okay. Uh, to finish that vault in the, in the community center. So maybe next episode, maybe I'll be able to sell enough stuff uh, in the next episode to be able to complete that. I might play through a day off episode, off camera since there's nothing going on for a couple of days. Oh, we got our on-fire squirrel. Okay. Always fun to see. Oh, and here is the completed bridge. Let's get off here and go forage and check out these worms first. Alright, that's all we need. Oh, but you stay right there. We're gonna go investigate. <gasps> yes, there are ore deposits. There is everything. There's wood. There's stones. There's ore deposits. Oh my gracious me. What a day. What a thing. Oh, I'm seeing some... I think... Is this one iron? 
Okay, yeah, that one's iron. This one is a diamond down there. And we got some amethysts. Oh, how exciting. I wonder if these respawn over time. Like you can or I wonder if just once you break through everything that's it and then you can't get you can't get any more. I am interested in finding out. Aww. That's so cool. So so cool. And then up here, what can this be used for? Out of order. I wonder if this is a reward from the community center. I'm not sure. Repairing these like mine carts. And so you can go maybe from out here to a place inside the mines. That'd be cool. Can I break through these? No, cannot. Can't break through those either. Okay. Just had to check. They are purely aesthetic. Good to know. There's so many. We're going to have so much stone. We're not going to know what to do with it all. I wish some hardwood spawned here. It looks like it's just regular wood. But here's some gold ore. Iron ore, copper. Got so many things. Let's get this diamond course. Oh, heck yeah. Try to get at least all the good stuff. Maybe like the gym and the ore deposits will respawn every day and you just have the chance to break through them all and and get to get to the good stuff. That'd be really cool. Oh, okay, cool. Um <laughs> remind me in three days? Snooze. Rinse repeat. Every time that update comes up almost, I just tell it to remind me in three days. Alright, it's getting a little late, so let's take our horsey Appa and ride back to the farm. Look at him, he's waiting there for me. So good. So very good. Let's actually try to fish since we're all the way over here. I haven't been doing as much fishing as I should. Maybe that's what I'll do the next couple of days when I play off camera. I'll do a little fishing, a little clearing on the farm. Woo 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 woo. Speedy! Speedy fishy! No! <laughs> oh my god. Jumpy! Oh, thank goodness. We got him. Oh, a largemouth bass. Nice. Oh, I think this is actually what Jody needed for dinner. Um... <gasps> yeah! Enters jo enter Jody's house with a largemouth bass at 7 p.m. Oh, Cool. We could actually maybe make it to her house. Whoops. For dinner. Eh, probably not. That's all the way down there. I don't think we'll make it in time. We'll do that another night. We'll go to Jody's house for dinner. Have her make us some fish casserole. Oh, I just noticed how low my energy was, by the way. <laughs> uh, good thing I stopped when I did, because I was not paying attention. Hey guys, let me know if you have any suggestions for new mods for me to install. Let me know if you have any suggestions for things that I should do in future episodes. I am still learning Stardew Valley. I've been playing it for a while, but I'm still in my first year. Uh, so clearly I have a lot, a lot to learn. Hi, Pupperinos. Alright, let's drop off Appa off back in his stable. Oh, I need to put uh, those cobblestone, cobblestones back here. Weird. Put them in... Okay, yeah, put those three in overflow. Boop. 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 Definitely need to do a little bit more reorganizing on the farm. Once springtime comes, I'll do a little bit more, like, aesthetic reorganization and get it... get the farm decorated a bit better. But right now, with everything so bare, I'm just not super motivated to... to do that. Uh, I think everything else I'm going to hang on to. Put these gems and mining. Put the... Uh, I think I'll keep the fish in, in my pockets. Just to remind myself about Jody's quest. And then this can go in foraged. Then we are good to go. Alright, I think we are done for the day. We're going to get another early early night. Oh, we've got some pine, 
pine tar to sell here. I know I already have, I think, wait, did I get rid of the pine tar in my, in my goods? No, I've still got some. I remember I had to donate one to the community center, so I couldn't recall if, uh, if I gotten another one since then. All right, let's head to sleep, see how much money we made. Uh, did we, I feel like we might have leveled up in something. I wasn't paying super attention to it though. Yes, we leveled up in mining, plus one pickaxe proficiency. We can craft bombs now, heck yeah. And on the 15th day of winter, we made 1800 gold. Awesome, yeah, we will definitely reach that 25,000 gold goal uh, by next week's episode to finish the vault and repair the bus. That's so cool. We're doing so many big things. Big things, guys. All right, thank you all so much for watching. I'll be back next Wednesday with a new episode. You all have... Oh, look, we've got Appa down here in our uh, little character summary now. I love it. Um, I got my other social media linked below if you want to check those out. You all have a wonderful day. Be kind to one another. Don't forget to be awesome. Bye.